In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the LCD screen in your BMW E30 six button OBC. If you'd like to purchase one of these kits, you can check the link below. Um, what you'll get is the LCD screen. It has nice frosted glass and looks very OEM. And um, the rubber connector strip, you'll see this later in the video. And then also a one year warranty. So to start, I'm going to show you how to remove the uh, remove the six button OBC from the dash. So I'm just going to take a small flathead screwdriver and uh, pop this faceplate off here. There we go, and you'll see the clips up here and down here. Just press that down and pull forward, and then do the same for the bottom. And you'll have the wire on yours, of course. And uh, take that out, and you get it out of the car. All right, next up, we're gonna separate uh, the OBC on this line here. So what we're gonna do is slide a small flathead screwdriver up here. I already did, th I already did this, so you uh, won't hear it, but when you do yours, you'll hear, hear little cracking sounds, which is just the adhesive uh, coming undone. So you'll do that for the top and the bottom, kind of just wiggle it around like that. And then you can put it in and just pull it apart like that to the top, and then same thing on the bottom. And then there you go. So the next step is to remove this light diffuser. And then you'll see those five screws. One, two, three, four, five. Just remove all of those. All right, and once those are removed, you can just pop this piece right out like that. And the next step is to remove the whole LCD assembly. You can see um, right in here is the LCD connector strip. So we're going to pull that whole thing out like that. And that's the entire assembly. And I'll show you the order that everything goes in. So that goes there. And then you have the or two orange filters down first and then the white one and the old LCD screen and the connector strip. Just like that. Now we're gonna take our new screen, take our new connector strip out. So this screen comes with a protective film on both sides. So you can just grab this tape here and that'll pull the one side up. And then for the back side, you just gently find the protective film. You shouldn't have to pick at anything at all. It should just come up pretty easily. And then you'll see there's a ridge at the bottom there that goes down and out or toward the inside of the OVC. So first we're going to place the LCD screen in. Try not to like touch it with my fingers to put a bunch of finger marks on it. And then do the filters next. And then we'll do this guy. And then we have to slide that, that uh, rubber connector strip right in that slot there. Get one end in. Might be slightly long, so you kind of have to coerce it a little bit. But it should sit completely down in, just like that. Should be flat, relatively flat, and then uh, we're good to go. Put this back on and tighten all of our screws back up. All right, so that's all good, and uh, we'll put our light diffuser back in, just like that. Let me take the other half. 
pop it all back together. And there you go, that's ready to uh, install, test it out, make sure it's all good. If you have any characters that are jumbled up, that means you're having an issue with the that rubber uh, connector strip and the LCD screen. So basically you just wanna like take disassemble and then reassemble and make sure that that's all good to go. Cool, thank you guys, uh, have a good day. Hope this helped you guys out a little bit.